Hi there! In this video I will show you how you can create a DCA bot on Bybit. DCA stands for Dollar Cost Averaging and this is an investment strategy where you buy crypto at a predefined interval for a certain period, no matter which price it has. DCA has the following advantages over a lump sum investment with a large capital. Firstly, it reduces the impact of market volatility because you spread your purchases over time and with that avoid the risk of buying a large amount at an unfavorable price. DCA also ensures that you consistently invest, regardless of market highs and lows. And finally, it's beginner friendly. It simplifies the decision making process because you don't have to worry about market timing. Just stick to the schedule and that's it. Let's do an example. Say that you periodically buy Bitcoin for every week on Sunday for example, and you do this for the next coming 4 weeks. The calculations are as follows. First the Bitcoin price is 20,000 and you invest an amount of $200. So in this case you buy 0.01 BTC. Now when the price is at $18,000 and you still invest 200, then you can even buy more BTC. In week 3 the Bitcoin price is $22,000 and still you buy for 200. And in the last week, week 4, you have a $19,000 Bitcoin price. You still buy for $200, which gives you this amount of BTC. And at the end of the 4 weeks, we have invested $800. In total, we bought uh, these amounts of uh, Bitcoin for every week, which resulted in a slightly above 0.04 Bitcoin. Now if we divide the 800 invested dollars uh, with this amount, then we get an average price of $19,656.50 per Bitcoin. Now you can buy crypto manually every week and there's nothing wrong with that, but you can also automate this process. Bybit has provided us with an automatic bot that handles the DCAing for us. So you only have to deposit a certain amount of money on your account and configure this bot to do the buying for you. And speaking of money, if you use my affiliate link when you want to start trading on Bybit, you also have the opportunity to claim extra funds and rewards so that your initial start amount for trading is higher than your original deposit. You just have to go through the KYC verification process and then deposit certain amounts of money to get extra rewards. That's free money you can claim to trade with on Bybit. So why hesitate? Use the link so you can start configuring the DCA bot as soon as possible. Now ok, to create the DCA bot you have to go to the menu at the top and select tools and then trading bot. In my case I only have the options uh, you can see over here in this screen because of the dreaded Dutch regulations, Spot Grid Bot and DCA. Now in my case I have to click on DCA. In the screen that appears right after the click you'll have several fields to fill out. Let me go over them one by one. On the right side of this screen there is an overview of the steps that you'll have to take to create the DCA bot. So why make things difficult? Let's just follow these steps. Select the currency first, uh, this is the quote currency of which you'll have to have funds of on your Bybit account. And to be precise, that money should uh, be on your funding account instead of your trading account. Otherwise the DCA bot cannot work. The second thing you'll have to do is to select the coins you want to attain over the coming period. And here I have a tip for you that you can use, because you can create multiple DCA bots for different types of coins. Let's say you want to have a DCA bot for layer 1 cryptocurrencies, uh, but you can also create a DCA bot for meme coins. This way you can diversify your investment strategy and also can see which type of coins have the huge gains for the coming bull market. The only thing that you'll have to be aware of is that the DCA bot does not have all the crypto to its availability. So you'll have to choose from the coins that are available. For this example I'll make a meme coin DCA bot and will buy Pepe, Shiba Inu, Doge and Floki. You can select up to 5 coins per DCA bot here. Then you'll have to make a choice about the investment you want to do for each period. So let's start first by selecting the period we want to use for DCA. In this case I'll choose weekly, but you can also select the periods of 4 weeks and even up to 10 minutes. However, you'll have to be aware that you'll have to pay fees here too. So every 10 minutes of buying will also cause more fees to pay to the exchange. Then it's time to determine the amount you want to pay for each coin. Here you can use your calculator and determine the weekly amount to use for each coin. So if let's say I want to buy $200 worth of meme coins every week, then I'll divide that amount by the coins I want to buy. And this will result in this case in $25 per coin per week. 
There is also here an optional max invest amount option at the bottom of this form, which I will not use. And here there are also two links that are useful if you do not have the correct amount of funds on your account. With these two links you can deposit new funds or transfer funds from another sub account to this account. This way you can start and create the bot. I will just click on the create now button and then the bot will be provisioned and then it's ready to buy each week at the time of creation. Now if you already have created the DCA bot but you want to alter the settings, you can do this as well of course. Just go to the menu and select tools and trading bots again. And if you already have bots configured, then select these running bots. And here select the DCA tab in this field. The buttons at the top of each DCA bot now have the following functions. The first button is uh, what I call the vanity button, where you can flex your gains to the general audience by posting to your social media channels uh, here by these buttons. The second button is to terminate the bot, which I will not do for obvious reasons. And the third button is to show you the details of the bot. Here are multiple tabs that give information about the bot's performances and the coins that it holds. On the status tab you can see the total investment, PNL, uh, the amount of buys and APR, and the positions that the bot currently holds. Also the order history shows the exact orders the bot has executed with all the details. And lastly the parameters tab can be used to change the parameters of the bot. Here you can adjust the interval, the amount for each coin and the maximum investment. So if you made an error or want to invest more or less into the bot, then you can adjust these settings over here. Finally click save and your bot is reconfigured and do the new DCAing for you. And uh, with this demonstration I'm at the end of this video. If you found this useful then please click on the like button and leave a comment below if you have one. Again, by using my affiliate link you can get additional funds for your account, so if you want free money then use that for creating the Bybit account. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye!